American Association for Environmental Education, an environmentally literate person is someone who makes informed decisions concerning the environment, is willing to act on these decisions to improve the well-being of other individuals, societies and the global environment, and participates in civic life. I'm pretty sure I know what you're thinking. Yeah, yeah, and so, I know, I know. Climate change, dying polar bears, too much burning of fossil fuels, and blah, blah, blah. But what does that really have to do with me? Well, to begin, are you familiar with the concept that everything on the Earth is connected in one way or another? According to the ecologist, very commoner, this is known as the first law of ecology. And we must remember that there is only one Earth for everyone. For the estimated 8.7 million species in all, and they are still counting. And not to mention for the 7.4 billion people. Everything must go somewhere, and this is what the second law states. A good example is, I think you've probably heard about the huge garbage patches in the middle of the ocean. Well, an estimated 8 million metric tons of plastic waste ends up into the oceans each year. Nature knows best, this is the third law of ecology. It's good to remember that the Earth would be fine without us. It may change, but it will continue on, regardless if we are here or not. But if we want to stay, we have to make the earth healthy and happy too. Then the final. There is no such thing as a free lunch, meaning everything gained comes at a cost. This is the fourth law of ecology. Here, think about this. Did you know that deforestation of the Amazon means it gets hotter and drier in the US Midwest, thus impacting global food supply? I know, it's a lot to process, but that's why we're here! Project L aims to provide inspiring content to learn about a variety of these related topics and take into consideration topics that you find interesting, but in an edited version. We have collected videos, links, articles on topics such as energy, food security, climate change. So you too can become more environmentally literate with links that show you how to get informed, engaged and involved. Don't hesitate to ask questions and provide feedback. We hope you will enjoy it!